Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's been a minute, I must admit. Uh, I haven't recorded a video in a long time. But anyway, before I get into the video, I just want to know how everyone is doing. Uh, you know, we've been quarantined for some time now and I just hope everyone is doing okay. And um, I'm just going to get back on this YouTube train again. <laughs> just gonna get back on this youtube train again and you know hopefully make you laugh or i know i don't know just just be like somebody that you can like and subscribe to <laughs> uh so today i'm just going to do a simple video actually i didn't want to to film it was kind of like a spontaneous idea or decision um as you can see i look really crusty i just wore a bit like okay an hour ago actually and uh i just thought that i would do a face mask while so like my skincare routine while i um do a quiz uh the first quiz that came to mind is the harry potter houses what are they called the yeah, houses right so i'm just gonna find out which house i fall into the houses that i am least likely to fall into is definitely slytherin and gryffindor maybe there may be a chance for gryffindor but uh i think hufflepuff is that other one and ravenclaw that i think those are the ones that i'm i, I might get i am i'm still awkward so Hopefully I get used to like talking to myself on camera. Let's get into it. Okay, so I just finished washing my face and the mask that I'll be using is this curette, cu curette I think that's how you say it. Collagen lifting care mask. I think you can find this like, there are like many of them, right? You can find them at Discam, or is it Clicks? I'm not sure, I got this from my sister. <laughs> like my pop, Mickey Mouse. I tried to pose for cute thumbnails, but it was impossible without looking like someone that came out of a horror movie. Okay, I think I'm on Time Magazine's uh, website for the Harry Potter quiz. This one sounds more serious. Okay, page one out of three. Okay, so this is basically like, um, so you have the question and then you have disagree and you have agree and you have number one to seven. I have used flattery to get my way. Uh, I'll say two. Maybe I used it without knowing, so I'll say two. Even if something scares me, I will not back down. Even if something scares me, I will not back down. Question two. Even if something scares me, I will not back down. I can't, I don't know what, how to answer this. <laughs> Four, five, four. I tend to exploit others towards my own end. No, disagree. If there is an important reason to face something that scares me, I will face it. Yeah, I agree. I'll give it a six. I often check my work over repeatedly to find mistakes. It depends what work. Like if it's something I'm not like that interested in, like boom, done, get over with, get it over and done with. So I'll have to be like four again. Eh. I wouldn't want people to treat me as though I were superior to them. <laughs> Why am I questioning? 
mentioning this i want to say uh seven but like as in agree but i'll say six if i am worried or anxious about something i would do or face it anyway two <laughs> Wow, I am definitely not getting Gryffindor or Slytherin. I know myself. I see myself as dependable, self-disciplined. One. <laughs> I'm being so honest, guys. Like, this is... I'm really honest. Like, I'm not really that self-disciplined. Like, I can exercise today, but I won't tomorrow. Like, even though it's supposed to be, like, a whole week's chat. Like, it's just who I am. And I'm trying to work on it. Uh, I am an ordinary person who is no better than others. Okay, wait. This, the way it sounds, it sounds like I am an ordinary person who is no better than others. It's like others are meant to be superior than me. Like, is it, like, if, if, if I am no better than others, is in like... I don't have a bubble hair, like I don't think of myself like like I'm not cocky or something. Cause if that then I agree. But if it's like others are superior than me, then I disagree. So I'll say four. I think that I am entitled to more respect than the average person. Disagree, but I'm not gonna put one. I just don't have, I don't know why. I don't want to say why. I do deserve a little bit of more respect, but so I'm just gonna say two. Isn't still a disagree, but it's not like a disagree like strongly. I see myself as a as critical curious curiosum. As critical I have no idea what curiosum means. Okay, so I'm gonna have to ask Google. The hell does critical chrism chrism what does chrism mean okay i can't even spell this word q r l sum given to or criticized by curling curling is like arguing like cure, cure right yes yes argue those are similar argumentative yeah i know what curl means but then when they say chrism it's like it's like another word for me you know Quarrelsome. Get results. I knew it. I, I knew it. I haven't taken this quiz before, but I just know. Your personality shows a high degree of work ethic. That is a lie. I never showed any. I was always in the middle. And shrewdness, which are valued among the members of Ravenclaw House. So I'm 46 point eight percent raven claw and forty three point eight percent hufflepuff nine point four percent gryffindor and zero percent slytherin yeah i mean that sounds i think the fact that it's like almost 50 50 with raven claw and hufflepuff suits my personality because i don't think i can be all the way raven claw i'm not that smart or academic or like you know and uh with hufflepuff hufflepuff are like the kind nurturing ones i think so i think like the fact that i fall and i've obviously you need a little bit of like that gryffindor so i feel like my results are really positive they suit me um i would have like i would have liked a little bit like maybe like a 1.5 percent of Slytherin. Just a little bit of savageness, you know what I mean? I'm a savage, yeah. Attitude, nasty, yeah. But I'm not that person, and so... Yeah, maybe I am and I lied a little bit there, or I don't know. But... As you can see, these are my results. There's a quiz in the description bar below, so you can take it yourself and find out. You know, maybe me and you are on the same team. How I look guys. I'm trying to take a different approach as well with my channel and just make you know random videos and not just stick to one thing. Maybe in the future I will eventually find like my ultimate niche but for now I'm just gonna do like you know just do my own thing you know.
and uh let me know what you think of the video stay positive stay motivated drink your water stay hydrated don't forget to like and subscribe i'm giving you this moment this chance to subscribe right now let's continue to grow as a family together on this channel uh okay i'm not gonna make this video long so bye quarrelsome